All right, guys, uh, in this video, I want to show you how to replace the rear O2 sensor in your Vauxhall Astra. Uh, this is a 2006 Astra H, and um, what I'll do is I'll show you the fault codes that we've been getting, first of all. Uh, this is it here. It's, it's the P0141 O2 sensor heater circuit bank 1 sensor 2. Um, so the four-cylinder engine will only ever be bank 1. Um, you'll get sensor 1 if it's... Uh, the pre-cat so you should be able to replace that from the engine bay but if you've got sensor 2 like we have then you need to um, go underneath the vehicle and you need to uh, replace the O2 sensor underneath um, so we've got the fault code here we've had the check engine light on um, this is the new sensor I picked this up I think it was about 24 pounds we got this for so um, it's quite a cheap part uh, we need to get underneath and um, sort of change it over. Now we've got um, we've got the carp on ramps. We have been running it recently, so we need to let the engine and the exhaust cool down before we can do any of the changes. Um, what I've also got is a O2 removal tool, which you might find handy. Um, I'll show you that. I'll just get that out of my toolbox and I'll show you that as well now. So this is the O2 removal tool. Um, it's, you can pick this up generally for about ten pounds. Um, and it's basically just a, a socket with a, a slice removed out of it and the idea is if you look at the O2 sensor if you figure that this part here is going to be in the exhaust how are you going to get a socket around it if you, you can't sort of put it over the top because then you well I suppose you could if you're going to chop the wires and take the old one out but then when it comes to fastening the new one up uh, you really need to, to get something which can sort of slot over that like such And then in like that. So once you've got it in, the idea is you can remove it or tighten it. It's got a socket on the end there. Um, so that's the tool. Pretty simple stuff. Um, the the 22 mil. They're generally a, a standard size. The O2 sensors, um, unless you're really unlucky. So um, we've used this tool on a lot of different cars: Toyota, Mercedes, uh, BMW. Vauxhall, uh, probably more that I can't even think of. Um, so yeah, so let's go out and have a look. All right, so we've got the engine running now. We've put the new sensor in. Uh, we just basically took the old one out, um, put the new one in, clipped it back up. Now the codes, they're still going to be there until we reset them. We've still got the engine light on, as you can see. All we need to do, though, is click on Erase Codes, and we should see the engine light disappear. There we go. Good stuff. Engine light has gone off. And it's all thanks to the uh, iCarSoft i902. It's available at Diagnostic World, it's www.diagnostic-world.com uh, Basically the uh, the kit will work not just on Astras, um, but you know, your other Corsas, Marivas, uh, Zafiras, Vectras, Insignias, things like that as well. Um, has quite a, a wide coverage. Um, so just check it out, click the link below the video, visit the website. Uh, if you've got any questions, just visit us on the website and we'll be happy to answer. Thanks for watching and I hope this helps.